Hey guys, Jamie today on Roblox. We are playing some more Pet Trainer, as you can see on screen right now. Also, there is a new update, which in this update actually doesn't say in the description of the game, but you just say it on their Twitter account. It says there is a new zone, a new wild pet, or the secret pets, as I usually refer to them because I forget what they're actually called, and a giant bush in Pet Trainer. By the way, I just realized. Even look at the side of my head for no reason. But anyway, there's a new zone. So we're also going to go and check it out. So we're going to go to the Magma Valley, I believe is what this place is called. And also we have the door right here. I'm hoping that I have enough. I mean, I have 20 billion, so if it costs more than that. Also, we have the Ancient Forest. Ooh. Hey, trainer, wanna spend 1.5 mil... Actually, that's a billion, isn't it? To unlock Ancient Forest. I mean, sure. I mean, I have plenty because we've been grinding the huge chest and there's a huge bush I can already see that looks like a tree not a bush but whatever okay so also got a new area let's see how much the coins I guess give you oh, actually they have like 1.2 million um, can I press F9 to actually see how much I get kind of like no actually it doesn't really it doesn't actually say how much you get like pet sim does I always thought it kind of did but I never really checked it Okay, so I have 18 bill, 523 mil. How much do I get? I get about a million for like the small coins. That's actually really good. We've got another NPC over here. Hey, it's been a long time since anyone went through this forest. Good luck with your adventure trainer. So pretty cool, kind of reminiscent of like Pokemon, I guess. Actually, it reminds me of um of the starter forest in like most Pokemon games, which is pretty cool, I guess. Um, so that's pretty cool. Okay, it's like it's just a dead end, also if until the next area, which will probably cost, let's see, 1.5 billion? Maybe like 5 billion, maybe 10 billion, I guess we'll see. But also we have a new giant bush, so we're just going to go ahead and just jump straight onto it. Let's see, so it has 300 million. Okay, that's going to take us a while to get through, but hey, hopefully it works. I mean, there is a new secret pet. In this update so also I want to try and find it it's actually in Nola butterfly it's called butter gloom in the bushes I wonder then if this giant bush can give me the hidden pet or the secret pet or if it's mainly or it may like gives you more candies than a, a usual bush would do because also if we go to our pets we can also see that the uh, hidden pets will give you free candies per bush the uh, ghost, which also is my clouder, or includes my clouder, also gives me five candies per bush. And my legendary one that I have, also the Hadron, only gives me two, which isn't really that great. But if I was to collect, if I was also trying to collect uh, candies from bushes, I'd also want to use as many ghosts as I can, just for the fact that it speeds up and I get also more per it. So. Maybe this giant bush only really is meant to like, give you more candies for destroying it, but I guess we'll see whenever we break it down, so I guess I'll be back in a second once it's done. Okay, we're back. It's about to end, okay? We've been here for... Actually, it's not been too long, I guess. I, I think about like 5-10 minutes, maybe. I haven't really been keeping track. I, I'd say about 10 minutes, so... Finally got it. We got... I think like 4,000 candies. That is very nice. Unfortunately, I didn't get the uh, the new secret pet alert, which kind of is upsetting, but that is amazing. That's like, I'm actually pretty sure I got 4,000 candies from that just alone, which is insane. What the heck is this? Just decoration? I guess so. But, hey, I'll take it. <laughs> I'm not complaining about that. Also, the chests here just have um, 4.5 million. I don't think there's a bigger chest than these. At least I haven't seen any yet, but I guess to get the secret pet, we probably want to start hitting up the smaller bushes just so we can get this done a little bit quicker. Although obviously they have a lot of health. Actually, did my pets level up? This guy was yeah. This guy actually got like 20 levels from that one bush, so they do have to get a good amount of XP as well from the giant bush. I'm pretty sure though. I, I at least it feels like I. It's worth. It's more worth to go for the previous giant chest in the um, 
in the ghost town area just for the fact that you get a lot of coins obviously to try and go for those legendary pets so i'm not really too sure i mean obviously it's great if you want candies so also now i can evolve as many pets as i want pretty much i mean that's amazing we got it as well amazing i'll take it there's the butter gloom okay new pet discovered which is very nice we've almost actually got all of the pets pet, in, pet x completed now I just need the legendaries from like every um, egg, so yeah, it's probably going to take me a while and it's probably not really worth going for them now, but let's have a look at this thing's stats then. So straight off the bat, um, it has 12,000 <clears throat> coins at level 1. That is a lot better than Clouder, we know that for a fact, um, just for the fact that this one is level 13 and it's 9,000, so that is amazing. I will take it. So I'm going to get rid of one of my clouders. 70, 69, 69, 70, and 161. Never mind. I guess I'll get rid of the one of these and I guess I'll also put this out. So I'm not actually too sure if that's actually better than the legendary from this one. I feel like it actually might be for the fact that this is level 89 and it's only like what five times better than it so I have a feeling that this is now the new best pet in the game which is great especially for me because I have the game pass as well so it might be worth going for those I feel like it's got to be better than this one as well like this is only it's actually not even four times it's probably got like 3.5 times better so I mean that, that was obvious because also this is a hidden pet and also this is a nuller like hidden secret pet so hey i will take a free pet that is very very strong also right now it's pretty like close to bones i level it up a little bit i mean once the um the giant bush spawns again i'll probably just put all my pets onto it just so i can level that bad boy up a little bit because that is insane i mean we're actually about to break 7000 candies as well so i gotta i don't really need to worry about candies ever again now pretty much which is pretty pretty good and there's another one <laughs> i'll take it man i'll take it so i'm gonna go straight ahead the only problem i'm really having gonna have then is i'm equipping these instead of obviously the clouders because they are better but it means i'm gonna get less candies from the bushes which isn't really too much of a problem because also they are gonna get them quicker so i guess it'll balance out when I get them high enough level at the very least, like one shot all of these. Um, but I guess if I really wanted, what I would really, really do is that obviously they have better coin stat, not a better candy stat. So I could just keep the clouders, level them up to the point where they can still one shot the bushes, and then just have a full party of clouders um, that can also one shot the bushes when I actually need to candies which won't be a bad idea it will just take a while to actually do that because also these have 450k health and my best clouder can do almost 80k so that's like what like five six hits pretty much which also isn't really going to take too long but still i feel like it's going to take a long time to get it to the level where it's going to be able to one shot everything but hey we've got the new secret pet we checked out the new a giant bush is actually going to take a while to spawn in what i actually could do because i have did by vip so for this game is which is by the way the best thing about this game is the vip servers because if i were to leave my game now my vip server and make sure it shut down and rejoin the giant chest in ghost town will be there straight away but might take like 30 seconds to spot to spawn in and the uh, giant bush will also be here as well so that's a really good method if you want to try and get as many candies or as many coins as you want is to just use VIP servers and just reset them and shut them down after every time that the giant chests and the giant bush it has been depleted and also you don't have to wait this really long and boring wait process for it to respawn back in by being in the same server so yeah it also costs robux so it's not exactly the best solution in the game in, in the world but it still works if you have like a bit of extra cash or if you just have any friends that have VIP servers for this game but pretty good anyway i'm gonna leave off there hope you guys enjoyed and like always see you guys next time